everyone. Welcome to the Edu Weekly Week 2022. My name is Bukola Ulusova James, and together with my colleague Abdul Fatal, we will be sharing our learning experience as a certified trainer of the Reading Wikipedia in the Classroom program with you all. Get comfortable, relax, sit as the session will commence now. Thank you. Hi, everyone. Welcome to Edu Week 2022. It's a virtual celebration of free knowledge in education and how Wikimedia Foundation as promotes education using its, its projects that cut across Wikipedia, Wikicommon, Wikidata, among others. So who we are, my name is Kola Urutola James. I'm a certified trainer of the Reading Wikipedia in the classroom program. And together with my colleague, Abdul Fatal from Ghana, we'll be sharing our learning experience with you all on reading Wikipedia in the classroom. Now, in the class of this presentation, We'll be talking about what Reading Wikipedia in the Classroom program is, the relevance to the education sector in Ghana and Nigeria, the impacts of this program on teachers and students, and the outcome of the training program. Also, we'll talk about our plan for the implementation in our local communities, and we'll wrap up this session with a question and answer and final remarks from the presenters. Thank you. So what's the Reading Wikipedia in the Classroom program is all about? It's a flagship teacher training program aimed at developing um, teachers, media and information literacy skill for the 21st century. And this program aligns with the UNESCO Media and Information Literacy Framework, which connects the French approaches and methodologies that are used in the classroom to leverage the power of Wikipedia. Now this um, program, adopted the UNESCO Media Information Framework, which is divided into three models for the teachers. And the first model talks about assessing information. The second talks about evaluating information. And the third model talks about creating information and how teachers can become content creators on Wikipedia. Now, for more information about this program, please kindly visit the Wikimedia Common under the category Reading Wikipedia in the Classroom. You'll find a lot of resources about this program. Now, uh, I would like to talk about the relevance of this program in the education sector of Nigeria and Ghana. Now, the, the impact of this uh, program on the education sector is that it will help improve the media and information literacy skills of teachers and students, as well as make teachers become content creators, not just content consumers alone, it would also promote the reading cultures of students and, and even teachers as well, and also create an alternative format for learning new things outside of the regular school curriculum. 
for both uh, teachers and students. Now we are in the 21st century where uh, everyone, everything is going digital and we are talking about IoT, Internet of Things. And it would be of a great uh, importance for students to not uh, stop reading despite the IOT uh, information explosion, uh, information overload. And this program is a great avenue for students to promote their reading culture using Wikipedia. Now, the impact on teachers and students in Nigeria and Ghana. The impact of this uh, program can be measured on teachers and students with their ability to use Wikipedia to assess and retrieve electronic learning resources. Now, uh, with this program, teachers would learn better ways of retrieving information online, retrieving not just any information, but reliable and verifiable information online. Again, this uh, impact would be measured based on the ability of the teachers to evaluate Wikipedia as a source of knowledge. Now, making them content creators that can assess and not only understand but evaluate the um, information on Wikipedia. Again, this uh, program would help teachers monitor Wikipedia and make it a safe place for students to uh, retrieve information from, as well as promote quality education for lifelong learning. So I have come to the end of my own um, session and please stay put because there's still more from Abdul Fatal. Thank you.